Welcome back to Jetline Marvel for another incredible aviation episode. Any aircraft's basic component, on which its capacity and speed are largely dependent, is its engine. However, recently, the majority of aircraft companies have come under fire for significantly contributing to air pollution in the environment, which causes global warming and other problems. As a result, companies like General Electric, Rolls-Royce, Pratt & Whitney, and others are currently working on developing new types of engines that may both cut carbon emissions and improve operator productivity. Airlines are concentrating more on sustainable fuel in the near future because it will be the only source that can replace the crude oils that come from the Earth's core and might potentially affect both the environment and our planet. Therefore, aerospace companies are working to construct engines using 100% sustainable aviation fuels, which can be produced naturally in the environment and also causes less harm to the environment. The first prototype of the ultrafan engine, which will be used in future aircraft, was completed by Rolls-Royce in December. This engine's innovation will undoubtedly aid in the achievement of net zero emissions for the environment and the aviation sector. We'll look at a few fascinating facts about it in this video. Number 1. It is the biggest aviation engine Rolls-Royce has ever produced, with a fan diameter of about 140 inches. This makes it bigger than the G9X engine, which is now mounted in the Boeing 777X and has a size of 134 inches. The GE9X engine has a thrust of roughly 490 kN, whereas this engine can generate 444.82 kN of thrust. Number 2. Additionally, the Rolls-Royce engine is compatible with 100% sustainable aviation fuel, which will be used in the demonstrator's first test early this year. Rolls-Royce has also created engines for Gulfstream aircraft, which are currently also SAF compatible. In addition, Rolls-Royce is intensively looking into hydrogen and hybrid electric power possibilities. Number 3. Rolls-Royce fan blades are constructed from a unique composite material. Rolls-Royce will switch to carbon composite fan blades from its customary hollow titanium blades, which will result in a 340 kg (750 pounds) weight reduction per engine. And because these blades operate at a low speed, they are unique. Number 4. This engine's dual-engine layout leads to a geared turbofan with a variable pitch fan system that promises an improvement in fuel burn of at least 25%. An overall pressure ratio of 71 and a bypass ratio of 15-1 are the goals of the geared variable pitch ultrafan. Number 5. The initial test gear's ratio will be close to 4-1 and its thrust could reach 440 kilo newtons, 100,000 pound of force. Variable pitch blades rather than a variable area jet nozzle are used to treat low speed fan instability caused by higher bypass and a lower fan pressure ratio. Moreover, get rid of the thrust reverser. Number 6. After the power gearbox, which generates secondary power thrust in a high-speed engine, the next section is the advanced core system, where compressed air will be generated, followed by lean burn combustion, and the last section is a high-speed multi-stage IP turbine system. Number 7. This engine competes quite well with the GE9X engine, which has a similar engine, but a somewhat higher thrust and speed ratio. The GE9X engine was launched and is specifically intended for the Boeing 777X, but in the future, the RR engine might be one of the options for that engine. Number 8. In addition, the engine will undergo standby time testing, which could be crucial for any engine manufacturer. The company built the cost of the specially built test equipment as 84 million euros, 94 million dollars. 
Rolls-Royce has constructed a power rig near Dolowitz, close to Berlin. Number 9. Ultrafan scalable technology from 25,000 to 110,000 pounds thrust delivers the potential to further improve the fuel efficiency of both narrow-body and wide-body aircraft by up to 10%. The engine will be employed in the upcoming aircraft, providing safe operations and 100% utilization of SAF fuel. Number 10. The Ultrafan Technology Demonstrator Program has been supported by the UK's Aerospace Technology Institute and Innovate UK, the EU's Clean Sky programs, plus LUFO and the state of Brandenburg in Germany. In the nearer term, there are options to transfer technologies from the Ultrafan Development Program to current Trent engines to deliver enhanced fuel efficiency and reductions in emissions. Thanks for watching, comment here with your thoughts on Rolls-Royce's latest ultra fan engine. Please subscribe to our channel if you are a new viewer.